Good decision to bowl first here. The openers won't find this easy in the early overs. Got to be a great chance for some cheap wickets. Players making their way out. It's a great crowd in today with plenty of atmosphere around this ground. Plenty of wickets on offer and runs. Batters and bowlers are in the game. And there's some quality players in both teams. So I'm expecting an even contest. Let's see what happens. Here we go with the first ball of the match. Nothing better than getting a match started and hearing the sound of Leather on Willow. Wow, that's missed a lot. Oh, that's got to hurt. Misjudged that one. Lanced away nicely, but fine short, fine leg. Gone. Great catch. Oh, great work. Held their nerve while the ball was in the air, and they've taken a good catch. The trudge back to the pavilion. A disappointing display in the end for someone with such batting skills. This one goes down as a fail. The field will come up now, you'd think. Pressure should be on as the new batter strides to the middle. They'll be looking for another quick wicket. Lovely cover drive, but straight to the extra cover fielder. Flex that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. Afridi sees the end of the over. A superb one it was. No runs and a wicket to show for it as well. The Manchester original. Now none for one. The left arm pace bowler is coming into the attack from the Stretford end. Big edge. Nearly got through them, just got onto it in time, and with enough bat speed to pick up four. Boundary last ball. What's to come this delivery? I wonder. Drilled that one away. Now, yeah, great opportunity to prove the critics wrong. Certainly needs to build an innings for the team. Please give him a warm welcome. Someone different now to bowl at. Brings a different set of problems. I feel it's just a matter of pitching the ball up and getting them onto the front foot. Pulled away, but straight to square leg. Finds the fielder with that shot. Massive outside edge. End of the over, 10 runs from it. The originals are 10 for one. Steady start, taking a bit longer than they would like to get set. They can launch from here though. Willie from the Brian Statham end.
onto that early. That could be four. Had a real flash at that one. Beautifully struck, too. Yeah, it can be very disheartening seeing good delivery smacked around. Sometimes, though, you've just got to accept it and move on. Great shot. Pulled straight to backward square leg, though. Can't get that outside the ring field. Five runs added in that over. The originals are 15 for one. It's been steady as she goes so far. Built up a solid foundation. Might be time for one of the batters to take a more assertive role. The right armour is coming into the attack from the Brian Statham end. Cuts that off well in the infield. Straight drive, mid-off will cut that one off. Was quick onto that in the infield. Big edge. Just got to follow up that last delivery. Found the edge, but no reward, but putting pressure on the batter. Go through it. It's high in the air. Fielder coming around, but it looks like it'll carry. Just sheer power off the back foot. Don't need to worry about running. Four runs out of there. The originals were 19 for one. Would have expected a bit more aggression that over. The run rate hasn't really gone up. Need to capitalise on their time at the crease now. Afridi, the left arm fast bowler, is coming into the attack from the Stretford end. Still honing in on their lines. The batter happy to let it go through. Huge edge. Let's just see if they can get that ball up into the slot as before. It's so crucial. You've got to follow up that last delivery and keep the batter under pressure. Straight to the fielder. Power and precision in that shot. 
doesn't even wait to see if the ball's going to do anything. Onto the front foot, punches it away to the boundary. Afridi ends what has been a tidy over, just needed to top it off with a wicket. Not the best power play they've had, nothing too outrageous or risky. They can look to work the gaps now though, let's see what happens. Played that beautifully. Saw the short one and got out of the way. No more of those in this over. No, no, no. Terrible shot. Nice shot, but straight to gully. Big edge. Saw it early and went for it muscled it to the boundary rather than timed it. Don't always mind getting hit for runs. What's important, just focus on getting the next delivery right. Massive outside edge. End of the over. Eight runs coming from it. The originals are 33 for one. This bowler knows how to give the ball an almighty tweak. Let's see how they go. Into the attack for Welsh fire. Swept away, but finds the fielder. Shot. Finds the gap with that one. That's just a brilliantly aggressive shot. Gets onto the front foot, and it's flown over the boundary. Thick edge. Time to follow up after such a great delivery. Pitch it on a length is obviously the way to go. Oh, that's been heaved away and punished over the rope. That's a brute of a maximum. That's just silly. The power on that shot is incredible. That's the sort of shot you want to see at a cricket match. End of the over, a very good one. 15 runs coming from it. The originals are 48 for one. They've got through the power play with a very good run rate. They can afford to work the ball with a little bit more risk now. Beats the outside edge. Good bowling there. Lovely cover drive, but straight to the extra cover fielder.
Glanced away nicely, but fine short, fine leg. And that brings up the 50 partnership for these two. Overstepping, just a little too eager on that delivery. Ball needs to get their run-up sorted. It's all gone horribly wrong with that last delivery. They're normally much better than this. Got that away nicely. Over the originals, a 54 for one. They've got busy working the ball around and hitting boundaries in between. It's a good setup for a strong finish. Ralph from the Stretford end. That's a confident appeal. Doesn't beat the infield. a bit unlucky. This innings cut short before it could really take off. They'll be disappointed they couldn't go on and score a big one. A difficult period as they come to the wicket. They'll take plenty of time to settle themselves in before facing their first ball. Van der Merwe coming back on here. They've been bowling really well so far. The new bowler into the attack for Welsh fire. Couldn't get it through the field. <laughs> Missed it. That was a chance. Caught. One of the easiest catches you'll see. Oh, great work. Held their nerve while the ball was in the air. And they've taken a good catch. As they head back to the pavilion, they'll be wishing they went about this innings a little differently. Not too much to speak of on the scoreboard. Coming to the wicket, they'll be looking to play within the V early and expand as they get settled. <laughs> Nearly gets the edge. Van der Merwe with a great delivery there. Great shot, pulled straight to backward square leg though. The end of a very tidy over. Batting doesn't seem to be that easy out there at the moment. Good pressure being exerted. 
It's been a bit of a battle finding some big overs, but they worked the ball around nicely. Massive outside edge. Time to keep the pressure on now. Great ball, that last one, to find the edge. It's just a case of finding the same spot. Pulled away, but straight to square leg. End of the over. A good one in terms of keeping the batters quiet. Just needed to take a wicket to make it an excellent one. End of the 11th over. The Manchester Originals are now on 52 for three. Green, the right arm medium bowler, is coming into the attack from the Brian Statham end. Two straight and punch through the leg side, mid wicket in hot pursuit. This is a masterclass of batting. Reads the length, gets forward, dispatches it to the boundary. Flex that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. Over the infield with a cracking shot. Lovely cover drive, but straight to the extra cover fielder. Straight drive, mid-off will cut that one off. Eight runs out of there. The originals, 70 for three. And Green the from the Stretford end. The Manchester originals are now 70 for three. Drive straight down the ground, mid-on will click that one though. but it drops safely. Just got to follow up that last delivery. Found the edge, but no reward, but putting pressure on the batter. Massive appeal. Might have just been missing, though.
That's a strong appeal. What's the umpire's decision? A great innings coming to an end. Brilliant scoring. It was a very entertaining performance, but have to head back to the pavilion. And with that wicket, we'll see a change out in the middle. The task here will be that of support and getting themselves settled into their innings. Finds the fielder with that shot. Good bowling in that over. Just the one from it. The originals are 71 for four. Runs have been at a premium this middle portion of the match. Van der Merwe coming back into the attack has done well so far. Gone! Played all around that one. What a delivery. Well, this is a fantastic wicket. Kept the runs down, really didn't get settled and looked to be in trouble for most of the knock. New batter comes to the crease. Never an easy time to come into bat after the fall of a wicket. Massive outside edge. The end of a very tidy over. Batting doesn't seem to be that easy out there at the moment. Good pressure being exerted. End of the 15th over. The Manchester Originals are now 74 for five. The over comes to an end. Not many runs coming off it. Both sides need to inject some life into this match. End of the 15th over. The Manchester Originals are now 79 for five. Green from the Brian Statham end. Oh, wow. That is out of here. That could be out of the ground. Well, that's what you pay your entrance money for. It's flown into the crowd. A brilliant shot off the front foot. No need to move. Don't always mind getting hit for runs. What's important is just focus on getting the next delivery right. Edged it.
Let's just see if they can get that ball up into the slot as before. It's so crucial. You've got to follow up that last delivery and keep the batter under pressure. Onto that early, that could be four. Doesn't even wait to see if the ball's going to do anything. Onto the front foot, punches it away to the boundary. Just need to keep it simple. Line and length, roundabout off stump. That'll force a mistake. Cracking shot over pitch and got what it deserved. That's four more. Caressed that nicely through the gap to the boundary. End of the over, a big one. 16 runs coming from it. The originals are 95 for five. The left arm medium bowler is coming into the attack from the Stretford end. Edge. Time to follow up after such a great delivery. Pitch it on length is obviously the way to go. Glanced away nicely, but fine short, fine leg. A tremendous shot just sailed away. Hit that so hard. Pressed forward, got the body shape right and launched it. One for the textbook. Can he come back with a dot ball? That was a tremendous delivery. Fizzed through to the keeper. No more short balls this over. Still honing in on their lines. The batter happy to let it go through. That's the over. The originals, 105 for five. End of the 17th over. The Manchester originals are now on 105 for five. And we'll have another five balls from this bowler. Edged. Winds up but misses. Looks like they went a bit too early on that shot. Got that away nicely. Gone aerial with that one, it'll land safe. Might not be four. Well, that was a poor ball. You really can't bowl like that. Got what it deserved. That last ball isn't something you want to repeat of. You don't want to be giving away easy runs. 
Walter waited on that and guides it down to third. Fielder coming around, may stop it before the boundary. Solid shot, really well played. Ball was just a little short, and that was a great shot off the back foot. Afridi, the left arm pace bowler, is coming on to bowl from the Brian Statham end. Smacks that away through the gap. Watched it closely out of the hand and hammered that slower ball away to the boundary. Avoided the fielders, one bounce and four fantastic shots. How will the bowler respond? Over the infield with a cracking shot. Oh, my, my, that's just flown off the middle. Well, he can't fault that shot. It's nicely played, and it was four runs all the way. How will he reply? Big edge. Nine runs out of there. The originals are 124 for five. End of the Willie coming on, obviously hoping the pace will cause some trouble. David Willie, the new bowler into the attack for Welsh Fire. Massive outside edge. Time to keep the pressure on now. Great ball, that last one, to find the edge. It's just a case of finding the same spot. Power and precision in that shot. Showed good composure to wait on that slower ball and find room to get the four runs. Just a fantastic shot. A uh, good contest here at the moment. Four off the last ball. It'll be interesting to see how the bowler can respond. No point chasing that one. It is racing to the boundary. Four runs. They were so still at the crease. Just a slight movement forward. Fabulous shots. Back-to-back -back boundaries. Can they make it three in a row? Really put the bowler on the back foot. Going a long way, what a shot. That's just a brilliantly aggressive shot. Gets onto the front foot and it's flown over the boundary. You give that much width and you are asking for trouble. That was so well timed, it flew over the boundary. And that's the end of the innings. The fire have been set a target of 140 runs.
The openers are coming out. It's a very gettable total. They just need to get off to a good start and not give anything silly away. It's the silly stuff that could give the bowlers a sniff in this match. Little coming in. Doesn't beat the infield. The new batter always likes to feel bad on ball as they bring a bit of nervous energy to the wicket. Smacked away. It may carry over the fielder for a maximum. Well, didn't time that at all, but managed to get it away to the boundary. Do they go full? Do they go short? A lot to ponder this delivery after the boundary. Clicks that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. Six runs out of there. The fire are six for none. End of the first over. The batting team are now on six for none. Five more balls for this bowler. Tongue from the Stretford end. Couldn't get it through the field. That is huge, enormous, massive, gigantic. Take your pick. Well, enough leverage there to get a good swing of the arms under it to get it over the rope. Ticking the scoreboard over really nicely at the moment. Two full and straight, it's punched wide of square leg, four more. Nearly got through them, just got onto it in time, and with enough bat speed to pick up four. Butler, I don't think, will be too happy with their bowler at the moment. Nice shot, but straight to gully. 13 runs added there. The fire, 19 for none. With two overs completed in the power play and at 12 plus and over, they're just ahead of the required run rate. Superb start. Gleeson. The right armour is coming into the attack from the Brian Statham end. Massive outside edge. Got to follow up that last delivery. Found the edge, but no reward, but putting pressure on the batter. Square cut, finds point, no run. Can't get that outside the ring field.
was quick onto that in the infield. That's the end of the over. Two runs added. The fire at 21 for none. End of the third over. Fire are now the one for none. The slow left armour is coming on to bowl from the Brian Statham end. No, no, no. Terrible shot. Magical shot into the vacant fine leg position, and I do not think anyone's going to stop that. Well, these are the sorts of shots you just stand and admire. Gets onto the back foot and rolls the wrists to keep control and find the boundary. Straight to the fielder. Wow, that's missed a lot. It's a very tidy over, but they still are searching for that first wicket. Maybe it's just around the corner. Gleeson coming back into the attack. Into the attack for the Manchester Originals. Great shot. Pulled straight to back with square leg, though. Gone. That's one for online. Square leg taking a ripper. Oh, wow. Brilliant reactions and what a catch. What a crucial breakthrough this is. Excellent bowling to get one of the key wickets cheaply. With the fall of that wicket, the new batter comes charging out to the crease. They're quick to take guard and face up. Please give him a round of applause. Drive straight down the ground. Mid on will click that one though. Across the stumps and a flick of the wrist. It's wide and square leg. Could be four. Errs on the side of bowling slightly fuller and have been put away. Yeah, it can be very disheartening seeing good delivery smacked around. Sometimes, though, you've just got to accept it and move on. Oh, that's beautifully struck right out of the guts and all the way. Well, that's what you pay your entrance money for. It's flown into the crowd. A brilliant shot off the front foot. No need to move. The shots are certainly being played at the moment. Some good batting mixed in with a little bit of good fortune. Two boundaries and two balls. Huge edge. Gleeson finishes an economical over and walks away with a wicket, which was fully deserved. Just ahead of the required run rate right now. One more over in the power play. A possibility of making some gains to their advantage next over, perhaps. Little back on now. Straight drive, mid off will cut that one off. Smacks that away through the gap. Needs a direct hit. Obviously didn't like the look of that one and just ignored it.
Lovely cover drive, but straight to the extra cover fielder. Just too much pace there. The trudge back to the pavilion. A good start, but that's all they've managed. They did the hard work and threw it away in the end. Well, that's a long way to walk out there, just to turn around and walk straight back. They'll just want to get this first run behind them and then push on. Drilled that one away. End of the over, the fire, a 43 for two. End of the sixth over. Welsh firemen are now on for three for two. Turner, the spinner, coming into the attack. Finds the edge. Time to follow up after such a great delivery. Pitch it on a length is obviously the way to go. And taken. Superb bowling. Gone. Fine catch. They've looked threatening but can't go on with the job. They'll be annoyed with themselves having gotten out after a start. And with that wicket, the new batter will mark centre. Just needs to rotate the strike early on as they get settled into their innings. Whacked away. You can't fault the bowling. Sometimes your opponent is just too good. Wonderful front foot shot, and there's no point chasing that. The originals managed to keep the batters pretty quiet in that over. They're certainly seeing some very good bowling. They've got busy working the ball around and hitting boundaries in between. It's a good setup for a strong finish. Massive outside edge. Let's just see if they can get that ball up into the slot as before. It's so crucial. You've got to follow up that last delivery and keep the batter under pressure. Edged it. The originals with a strong appeal. That should be given. Nicely done by the keeper. An innings that promised much and really, in the end, delivered very little. Pretty disappointing all round. Yeah, big opportunity. They've worked really hard in recent weeks. They should have the confidence to build an innings and get a big score on the board. Pulled away and into the gap. Could be four more.
finds the fielder with that shot. Turner finishes an economical over and walks away with a wicket, which was fully deserved. Tung from the Stretford end. Pulled away, but straight to square leg. They've gone up here. Trudge back to the pavilion, a disappointing display in the end for someone with such skill. This goes down as a fail. A lot of pressure coming to the crease, not had the best of weeks leading up to this game, so I want to show everyone their strength. Square cut, finds point, no run. but it drops safely. Time to keep the pressure on now. Great ball, that last one, to find the edge. It's just a case of finding the same spot. Cuts that off well in the infield. Misses. That's a big chance going begging. End of the over, and it's a good one for the bowling side, not letting the batters build any momentum. With 50 balls remaining, Rush Fire move in one runs and have five out. Power and precision in that shot. Well, he sometimes just have to stop and admire batting like that. Gets onto the front foot early, well-timed, and four runs. How will he reply?
Lovely cover drive. He's straight to the extra cover fielder. Flex that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. That's the end of a very good over. Great pressure being placed on the batters here. End of the 11th over. Well, fun. I'm now on 66 for five. And we'll have another five balls from this bowler. Walter from the Brian Statham end. Over the infield with a cracking shot. Couldn't get it through the field. End of the over. Five runs coming from it. The fire, the 71 for five. End of the Lemonby five. coming into the attack from the Stretford end. One for five. Tom Lemonby, the new bowler, into the attack. Great shot. It was a good length to try that, and they did that with maximum results. Six more. Well, that's a waste of a delivery. Absolutely no trouble getting onto it and dispatching it for six. Might look to go big again here. Can't get that outside the ring field. A lovely delivery, got it in short and surprised them. They'll be happy only one of those is allowed. Does very well to quickly get across to this one. End of the over, seven runs coming from it. The fire, a 78 for five. End of the 13th over. Well, five are now to the eighth for five. Tongue back into the attack. Driven on the onside, but straight to mid wicket. Doesn't beat the infield.
ticking the scoreboard over really nicely at the moment. Nicked it. Just got to follow up that last delivery. Found the edge, but no reward, but putting pressure on the batter. Huge edge. That's a confident appeal. End of the over, four runs coming off it. The fire are 82 for five. With 30 balls remaining, Welsh fire need 58 runs and have five out. Lemonby from the Brian Statham end. Edged it. Pulled away, but straight to square leg. Great shot for six. Moving along nicely and starting to really build this innings. Gone aerial with that one. It'll land safe. Might not be four. That's textbook perfect. A lovely drive through the covers. There was no need for the fielders to chase that. Back-to-back -back boundaries, can they make it three in a row and really put the bowler on the back foot? Big edge, where's that going? End of the over, fire, a 97 for five. End of the sixth, the right armour is coming on to bowl from the Brian Statham end. The new bowler into the attack. Turner, straight through them. Batter was late on that one. At long last, they have the wicket. Could so easily have been a game-changing innings. All the same, it's been fabulous to watch. Is the new banner for Welsh Fire. First ball for the batter, coming in. Full toss and worked off the pads nicely. Could well be four. Four runs. They were so still at the crease. Just a slight movement forward. Fabulous shot. Can he come back with a dot ball? End of the over. Five runs coming from it. The fire. 102 for six. Was quick onto that in the infield. Mm. 
massive outside edge. Time to follow up after such a great delivery. Pitch it on length is obviously the way to go. Great shorter ball. Well played, though. Didn't flinch and was able to leave the ball comfortably. That's the end of the short stuff for this over. Green watched it closely and let that go through to the keeper. Edged it, no one there. It could be four. Let's just see if they can get that ball up into the slot as before. It's so crucial. You've got to follow up that last delivery and keep the batter under pressure. Go through it. It's high in the air. Fielder coming around, but it looks like we'll carry. Nearly got through them, just got onto it in time, and with enough bat speed to pick up four. The originals managed to keep the batters pretty quiet in that over. They're certainly seeing some very good bowling. Lemonby from the Stretford end. Out! Caught! Simple as you like, the batter didn't bother to look at more than one delivery in that over. Not a bad innings, was really starting to up the run rate, but cut short a really important wicket to get at this stage of the match. Ooh, good bowler. Everything seems to be good, but then you've got to watch it almost sail out of the stadium. Wonderful shot. Getting nice and settled at the crease now. Would have to be very happy with that last shot. Oh, now then, that's high in the air. Batters should get a few here. It's flown into the crowd. To get that much power coming forward on the front foot is ridiculous. Boundary last ball. What's to come this delivery? I wonder. Goes over the top with that shot. It's an outstanding shot. Saw it early, not much width to play with, and drove it through the covers for four. End of the over, the fire are 128 for seven. They've gone up here. The originals having a good chat with the captain. Not sure this one is worth a review, though. Was there a bat on it? The fielders think there was. This could be trouble. Now, I didn't pick up on anything there. Very close to the bat, though. The eighth wicket to fall. The opening batters out there in the field will probably be starting to prepare themselves for their own innings. He's got their tail up. Lovely cover drive, but straight to the extra cover fielder.
drive straight down the ground. Mid-on will collect that one, though. Four runs out of there, a fire, 132 for eight. There was some wonderful stroke play on offer for the fans here. Bowlers just weren't tight enough. End of the Walter will bowl the final over the match. They really need a boundary, this ball. Track. Head was completely still, and they struck that hard, high, and long for six. Jumped all over the slower ball, only gave them more time to see it and make sure of it. Scores level now. Just one run needed. Only a batting meltdown will stop victory now. Huge edge. Time to keep the pressure on now. Great ball, that last one, to find the edge. It's just a case of finding the same spot. From all of us here on the commentary team, I hope you've enjoyed the match. Ended up being a very close one. Hope to see you soon.